Following total atomic annihilation, the rebuilding of this great nation of ours may fall to you. That's why we at Vault-Tec have prepared these educational materials for you to better understand the seven defining attributes that make you special. Got your rabbit's foot? Good. It's time we talk about luck. The difference between whether you live or die in the post-nuclear world may depend on the flip of a coin. Luck is a mysterious sort of curiosity. See here? A well-placed shot may not always do the trick. If Lady Luck favors you, though, you'll find those critical moments a breeze. What's this? Only scrounging up duds? Time and patience may net you a suitable collection, but with luck on your side, you're bound to find some swell keepers. No, no, hold on to anything shiny. It may be of hidden value. Be careful not to get distracted by your newfound fortunes. Uh-oh, that wasn't the only pest. It looks like luck has helped you once again. Unfortunately, she can't save you from every situation. At least your misfortune can become someone else's fortune. Luck may be fickle, but if you can woo her to your side, the possibilities are endless. A particularly bloody mess with little a chance to build a streak of destruction that cut the magic of the unexpected all. Regularly study your vault tech provided materials to prepare for survival. And to answer the question, do you know what makes you special? Greetings and salutations everyone and welcome back to Fallout 4. Where in the last episode we um, entered the city of Cambridge, not College Square. <laughs> we um, cleared out College Square, came to uh, the rescue of the Brotherhood of Steel, basically. They were in the firefight with Girls some ghouls. Stop on their heads in power armor. Yeah, I know, Reese. Maybe you can talk to someone else. Talk to Scribe Halen. Um, yeah, so uh, we came to their aid, and in return they asked us to aid them some more. Um, which, nice guys as we are, um, yeah, will do. And we um, investigated the whole station, the whole police station, looted everything we could. And it's not a good idea to keep Paladin Dance waiting. Yeah, okay. Can can maybe everyone just not talk to me for a second? Yes, is that an option? Thank you. Um, because we want to uh, check out this terminal. Uh, we've checked out all the other stuff here in the in the station, and this terminal is the last thing we need to check before we can talk to Paladin Dance and then leave uh, Scribe Halen and Night Reese to their devices. So, what's going on here? Recon Squad, Gladius, orders. Recon Squad Gladius's current orders are as follows. Proceed to the area designated as the Commonwealth to perform a standard long-range recon operation, LRRO. Report any unusual activity using standard long-range communications to Scabbard. Extraction time undetermined. A paladin dance. Okay. Paladin dance personal logs. Log one. After several months, my squad has just crossed the border and entered the Commonwealth. 
We've chosen to immediately search the Boston region with the intention of finding a secure building to use as our recon headquarters. Soon after, my squad was ambushed by raiders. Knight Keen's power armor was destroyed and we lost some of our supplies. Fortunately, we were able to repel the attack and continue our mission. Log number two. We've discovered a secure building in Cambridge that appears to be a former police station. We were able to clear the building and recover a good deal of supplies and ammunition from pre-war caches inside. According to Scribe Halen, this location is structurally sound and highly defensible. I've decided to establish our headquarters here for the time being. Well then. Log number three. After Halen identified the Covega factory in Lexington as a possible site containing viable pre-war technology, mm, no it isn't, um, we, <laughs> we initiated a sweep and retrieve operation. I had Dawes do a site survey and he discovered it was being held by a large force of raiders. I gave the go-ahead and we attempted a breach. As we approached, our squad was hit with gunfire. Knight Warwick was wounded, so I decided to fall back to Cambridge. During our retreat, Knight Brack stepped on a landmine. Scribe Halen attempted to treat him, but Brack succumbed to his wounds and died. Let it be noted for the record that Halen is to be commended for her efforts. Okay. Number four. It's been two days since our failed operation at Covega, and I'm sad to report that Knight Warwick has died. His gunshot wounds had left him paralyzed and internally bleeding. Scribe Halen informed me that he was suffering and had less than 5% chance of recovery. I authorized her to inject him with an overdose of painkiller and put him to rest. I'd once again like to commend Scribe Halen for her efforts in keeping Warwick alive and for following my final orders without question. Number 5. We sustained another casualty today at Grid Reference A113. This area contains the ruins of Boston International Airport and Fort Strong. The airport was almost completely abandoned, but Fort Strong turned out to be infested by super mutants. We were hoping to resupply at the armory there, but Knight Sergeant Dawes was killed. This is the second location I've had to order a retreat from since we arrived, and the third member of my team to die. I recommend a complete bombardment of this location in the future. Well, we'll see how things turn out. Number 6. Scribe Halen has been picking up unusual energy readings on her instruments. She claims that they are on an extreme high band spectrum frequency, which makes it highly unlikely to be pre-war in origin. The readings are also highly sporadic, only appearing for very short amounts of time and in very specific locations. The decay on these signals is severe and they seem to disappear off Halen's instruments after several hours. We don't have the equipment necessary to track these readings, so we're attempting to use triangulation to discover their point of origin. Well, good luck with that. Number 7. We've been attempting to contact Scabbard with the energy reading Halen has collected, but the police station's high-gain antenna was damaged by a supermutant rocket attack, and we can't transmit the data. Halen is attempting to repair the antenna, but she isn't certain that we have the parts we need at this time. Yeah, you don't. Gladius personal status. Okay. Night Sergeant Dawes. Deceased. Knight Reese. An asshole. Knight Keen. Deceased. Knight Brack. Deceased. Knight Warwick. Deceased. Scrape Halen. Status active. Okay, beautiful. So, yeah. Um. Seems like dance is not uh, the most 
efficient or, or the best leader or something on that along that line. Alright, Dan, talk to dance. me. You ready to move out? Why the police station? Why establish an outpost at the police station? Given the nature of the facility, we felt it would be tactically advantageous to search it for weapons and ammunition. The radio well, you're not wrong. on the roof was an unexpected boon, but it obviously has its shortcomings that need to be rectified. It might not be as imposing as the Citadel back in the capital wasteland, but it suits our purposes. Hmm. That's all I'm willing to divulge at this point. Mm -hmm. Are you ready to proceed with the mission? Um. Yeah, ready? sure. Stand. Let's go. Follow me and try not to lag behind. <laughs> All right, dogmate. This will be fun. I know, buddy. Can you maybe take some more of my junk? No, no, nothing. Okay, buddy. I'll have to carry it myself then. Can we not? Here we go. All right, and he's off. Dude, slow down. We'll take this alley. Follow me. Yeah, we'll take the alley. What's with the blue? Hmm, okay. Arc jet is a short hike to the west. If we take this road, we should be able to avoid the larger packs of ferals at best in Cambridge. Traveling this far from the police station is a risk. Mm -hmm. Getting that transmitter up and running needs to be our top priority. If it was up to me, I'd relocate my team. But Scribe Halen detected some disturbing energy readings in the area. So Look at that, Tato. We don't know much about them. Out of my Ooh. ammo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Gray knit cap. I'll have that. Haha. <laughs> Disarmed ya. And so. We live another day. Carl Max? What the? What is comics? Huh. Oh, 38 rounds, squirrel on a stick, sea captain's hat. Well, let's uh, check out those new hats. We've got the faded visor, one perception. Great luck. Yes, please. We need luck. Sea captain's. Oh, plus two endurance? And we could use that. But we can also use the luck. So, yeah. That's uh, beautiful. Um, let's use the gray knit cap. Nope. Uh, nope. No. All right, dance. Let's get on with it. Hmm. All right, Dance, you know the drill. You gotta wait for me. Because... Loot. I hope. No, no loot. Well, we'll take that. Cooking pan, pompadour wig. What were they doing with all those weeks? Military cap. Military cap? What do you do? Plus one perception. Well, that's all right. We're quite perceptive already. Hmm. Dance, what did you do? 
Oh, hi guys. Yeah, he's got that. Hmm. Neutralized and pacified. Compensated light. Well, we do have enough. 10 mil pistols. Oh, you. Yeah, yeah. Uh huh. Okay, so uh, these raiders raided a caravan, and this caravan had some pretty good loot, if you ask me. Professional bell glasses. Hmm. Okay. Military frequency AF95 signal lost. What? Ah, okay. Um, mm -hmm. Anything good in here? Yes, there is. Casual outfit. Mm. <clears throat> Some more flowers. Anything good down here? Ah, oh, not really. All right, Dance. What's going on? Why are you just standing around here? Let's get a move on. Come on. I ain't got all day. Ooh. What? So, no key? Nice. Probably not, yeah, not part of the wicked chipping thingy. This is the Minuteman symbol, isn't it? Let's take all of this. Bottle caps. Gwinnett Brew. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. Some red stack. All right, dance. Um. Yeah, man, we, we only got five kilograms left. Hmm. Sooner or later, we need to drop stuff. And why not start now? Pull Q. Pine glasses. Fate Advisor... Patrolman Sunglasses, we only need one. And the rest is junk. Quite valuable to us. Oh, what's this? No way! <laughs> yeah! That's a super mutant! Yeah, yeah, I'm seizing fire. Okay, let's take all of this. And this. And 
let's have a look at the ashes of the super mutants orders okay yeah we'll uh, re we'll read those aboard short pipe rifle um dance wait a sec we got some super mutant orders we need to read kill loot return well um <laughs> yeah okay a very very well worked out plan very very well thought out plan as well dude that Alpha Wild Mongrel. That's for you, Alpha. Oh, there was another one. Okay. Let's take all of this. Wasn't there one killed up here? No. Maybe in the bushes? No. Oh, look at that. Red stack. Yeah, let's take all of it. And another one. Mm-hmm. Arcjet systems, yeah. So we'll head in through the front. Okay, yeah. Um, give me a sec. Because, um... Dogmate and I need to check this out. I agree, Dogmate. Woohoo! And anything else good in this area? Huh. Yeah, we've we got that, dot meat. I got the loot. Got the caps. And the stim pack. So okay, mylark. Another mylark. Okay, um hmm. Where's Dance? Oh, he's waiting at the entrance. Okay, good. Good boy. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Hmm. Okay, yeah, I believe uh, there's nothing else around here for us to loot. Or is there? Look at you. Squirrel bits. Okay, yeah. Worth it. Hmm. All right, dance. Let's dance. Paladin dance. Listen up. We do this clean and quiet. No heroics and by the book. Understood? Sir, yes, sir. Um, not my first rodeo. This isn't my first rodeo. I understand that. I'm simply offering valuable tactical advice. You'd do well to listen. Remember, our primary target is the deep range transmitter. Stay focused and check your fire. I don't want to be hit by stray bullets. Don't you worry. Okay, dogmate. Let's go inside. The Arcjet systems. Okay. It was corporations like this that put the last nail in the coffin for mankind. They exploited mm -hmm. Pocketing the cash and ignoring the damage they've done. 
Um, yeah. Mm -hmm. Ooh, look at that, a Nuka Cola. Um, a gun? Yeah, I'm already over encumbered. Okay, um. Hmm. Hmm. Let me just uh, quickly go through the junk and I'll be back in a sec. Okay, um, yeah, that's a lot of stuff we just dropped and we won't be picking it up again. Um, but let's take a look at what to, where to level into next. Um, Idiot Savant, we need to be level 34 in order to um, take the last um, perk point here. So, locksmiths. Do we want to go into hacking or locksmith lock picking? We'll need to do both at one point. So, let's start with uh, lock picking. Make sure that we can pick um, expert locks now. And next step will be master locks, and the one after that, uh, we'll make sure that none of our bobby pins ever break. Um, so yeah, or maybe, mm, okay, maybe I should have gone into something like that to do more damage. But um, yeah, we've got we're, we're with uh, Dance with Paladin Dance, so he'll make sure that we speak to Paladin Dance. Yeah, it looks like it. Is this Brotherhood? the Brotherhood of Steel's handiwork? Unfortunately, no. Look at the evidence. There isn't a single spent ammunition casing or drop of blood in sight. These hmm. robots were assaulted by Institute Synths. Mm-hmm. Synth? What? Isn't that the same as robot? They're an abuse of technology created by the Institute. Abominations meant to improve upon humanity. Mm -hmm. It's unacceptable. They simply can't be allowed to exist. Okay. What's the Institute? What's the Institute? They're a group of scientists who went underground when the Great War started. Spent the last few decades littering the Commonwealth with their technological nightmares. Mm-hmm. It sounds like you're scared of synths. There's a measurable difference between being frightened and being prepared. Mm -hmm. Now, let's move out. All right. Dance. Oh, look at that security terminal. Um, shotgun shells, yes, please. Let's check out that terminal. Um, security concerns. From Thomas Reinhardt, CEO, to all security personnel. I'd like to have your team get together and implement a new security strategy for the ArcJet complex. This is our first contract for the USSA, and I don't intend to have any security slip-ups while we're working on the XMB booster engine. I want you to double the coverage 24 hours a day and install automated countermeasures inside the facility. I'd also like you to hire a consultant to figure out a better security password system for our terminals. The automated reset timer mailing out passwords is ridiculous. Okay, turrets. From Sam Brent, security lead, to all Arcjet employees. Starting tomorrow, we'll begin distributing identification badges to all employees. These badges must be worn at all times. They are infused with a low-yield radioactive isotope that will prevent our internal security turrets from accidentally shooting any of our own employees. If anyone is caught near the entrance to the engine core without a badge, we are not liable for the injuries you may sustain. The turrets will go online in one week. So I'd suggest you sign up for your badge as soon as possible. Well, um, yeah. 
Engine core accident. Thomas Reinhardt, CEO to Sam Brand, security lead. Sam, what the hell is going on down there? How did a member of the press get all the way past the security, through the entire research facility and into the engine core without tripping our alarms or turrets? We have a real mess on our hands and it's going to be your job to clean it up. I don't care how you do it, just make it all go away. If this comes back to bite us, I swear, you're going to be the one that takes the fall. Well, spoken like a true CEO. Protectron control. Activate units. Well, they're all kind of broken, so there's nothing to activate. I still see a few pieces of salvage that the Brotherhood might be interested in. After we're done here, we'll have to mark this place for sweep and retrieve. Mm-hmm. Is that so? Okay, well then. Anything in, the, in those desks? No. Wooden spoon. Ooh. A couple of rounds. Another wooden spoon. They're big on spoons here. Looks like a dead end. See if you can Nothing find in there. Hey, do you do that? You do that. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. So we need to get in there. Mm hmm. Anything good in your corner? No? Okay. You'll let me know if you find anything, right? Right? Yeah. Okay, globe. Ooh, discarded arc check work log. Let's uh, play you. Why the heck are they making us record this? Oh, crap, it's on, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> um, this is Technician Rand, Arc Jet Propulsion Division. I'm here Lab with Technician Janowski, Work Log A1190. Lab control Janowski terminal. and I have been working on the Mars Shot Project for about three months now, and I think we have the thrust calculations worked out. Man, I wish I was headed up there with those guys. It'd be nice to get the hell away from our lousy planet. <laughs> hey, easy. If we don't record these logs properly, we're going to get fired. The supervisor is already itching to get rid of us, especially since it's taking us longer than we promised. So what? We've been drafted anyway. We're shipping out in a few weeks, remember? <sighs> Soon we'll be doing push-ups, eating freeze-dried rations, and just wishing we were spending our day inside a cushy private laboratory. Of course I remember. But I'm trying not to imagine getting my head blown off when I'm on the front line, and keeping my mind on work is helping me deal with the problem. Okay. Maybe that doesn't make sense to you, but it's important to me, okay? All right. Sorry. Look, why don't you toss this tape and we'll start a new one. Hmm, okay. Reminder, password security. From Sam Brandt, security lead, to all staff. This is our annual reminder that all terminal and mainframe passwords are to be changed on a monthly basis. Failure to do so may result in automated changes, the suspension of network privileges and or disciplinary action. Please do your part in keeping ArcJet systems secure. Well then, let's uh, change the passwords. ArcJet, ArcJet lab password changed. New password is 9YB3N. All right. We've got a new password. Unlock ArcJet lab password. Login admin, required password. Okay, good. Lab control, secure door control. Um, accessing prototype interlink, error. Unable to establish a connection to the prototype. Please contact a technician for assistance. Well, we won't need assistance. We will need to open this door. And once the door is open, we will need to fight. Hi, guys. 
these are synths. Okay, thank you, Dance. A shock pattern, fusion cell, institute pistol. Alright. We'll take care of it. Mm-hmm. Why did you retreat, Dance? Well, retreat is kind of his thing, isn't it? Yeah, I see that. Very good. Well done. Um, okay, these are the machine gun, these automated turrets. Um, hmm. And we're over our limit again. Uh, Yeah, let's leave the baton. Well, take the pistol, because I'd like to have one of those uh, weapons. The mines, though... Hmm. Tell you what. Let's eat a, a rat stack steak. Grilled rat stack, right? Yeah. There we are. Increasing our carry weight. And making sure that we can continue looting. Mm -hmm. Ooh, look at that. A pack of duct tape and a microscope. Damn synths have compromised most of the facility. Did they? Dogmate, we need to go through here. Thank you. Flip lighter. Aluminum. Fusion cell. A weapons workbench. Can we do. Oh, um. <laughs> Dog meat. You do have the. Um... Heads up. You do have that pistol with the suppressor, right? Can you maybe. Weapons. There. This one. Thank you. Let's take you. Um, suppressor. Let's. No muzzle. Yes, that's right. Let's. Um, take our trusted. Put the suppressor on here. Now look at that. We um, lose on range, but we gain accuracy. Yeah. We do gain accuracy and, well, value, but I don't intend to um, sell that one. So, yeah, that's good. And anything else? So, we can. I guess we can drop that. Glow sighted armor piercing pistol, then we don't need that because we got this one. <laughs> silent, or at least uh, silenced. Oh, uh, institute rifle. Yeah, we need that, or rather, I need. Oh, 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 okay. Is there a... Yeah, there is. A laser tripwire. Sneaky. Tesla arc. These things electro electrocute you and do real 
heavy damage. So, good thing we caught that. Mm, 10 mil rounds. Adjustable wrench. No need for that. Security's too yeah, good. expert lock. Mm. But thank goodness we can unlock or lock pick expert safes now. Okay, yeah, I see what's up. Yes. Mm-hmm. Red X. Okay. Uh, chemistry station. Let's unlock you. Dog made fingers crossed for ammunition. Okay, there we are. Go watch shotgun shells. Stealth boy. Okay, stealth boy. Uh huh, take this. Institute pistol. Alright, I believe we're done here. So let's uh, unlock this. Rounds, military grade duct tape, wonder glue. Oh, a vacuum tube. Huh. Do we need to go up here? Remain vigilant. We've got turrets ahead. Oh yeah, this is okay. Yeah, no no no, sorry. I did not want to proceed the quest just yet. Toy alien, okay. Yeah, dance will manage, right? Dogmate, he's got the big power armor. Nothing can hurt him. He's fine. Wasn't there a terminal somewhere? Follow Paladin Dance. Yes, uh, will do in just a second. Wasn't there a terminal somewhere here? Didn't we? Yeah, this one. Here, right here. Oh yeah, expert. Mm, bugger. Okay, Dance. Was there something? Nope. Nothing. Okay, Dance. We're coming. Ooh. Oh, oh, ho! look at that, Tesla signs. Yes. Energy weapons permanently inflict plus 5% critical damage. Thank you. CEO's terminal. Okay, this is the boss's office. And we're over encumbered again. Man. Let's do pistol. All wise now. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, I'll just have to ditch some more. Um, like the baby rattle. Well, let's uh, let's go like this. Okay, so this is the CEO's office. Um, Dance, where are you? Dancing around? Huh. Let's unlock the safe. Mm-hmm. Okay. So maybe over here? Or maybe a little bit more? Somewhere in between? Yes. Got it. Let's take those rounds, bottle caps, and let it show what? Let it shadowed leather left arm. Okay. Um yeah. Thank you, but uh, no thanks. Let's check out that terminal. 
um, in the next episode. Let's take a break here. When we come back, we'll check out that terminal. We'll follow Paladin Dance wherever he went. And uh, yeah, we'll get to the bottom of what's um, happening here at the ArcJet um, Institute. So, yeah, I hope you liked the episode, and if so, maybe consider giving it a like, share, or subscribe. And I hope to see you in the next episode. Until then, bye.